Welcome to Lesson 4, Variables. Variables are very simple inside of PHP. All we need to do is have the, the dollar sign and then a variable name. That's basically all you need to do. Now, variables cannot start with a number. This would be invalid. Variables can start with an underscore, but after the underscore, underscore it cannot start with a number. However, it can start with a number score and then some letters. And also, you can have letters and then numbers. To assign a variable, all you need to do is write down your variable and then equals and then whatever you want it to equal. Just like that. You can also assign it here when you uh, first declare the variable. And we are also able to use our variables in multiple situations, such as an echo. We put a period in between our string, our main echo string, and the variable. This basically connects the two. Of course, you can also just do echo variable. That works too. save this and then go to our page oh yes of course our invalid variables are causing some problems there we go now you can see that our first variable is equal to 11 and then since we reassigned our variable it now equals 10 We can also use the variables and ifs and while well, stuff like that. You can echo it out, print it out. So basically, you can do everything with a variable. Ah, also, combining just a quick little tip if you're using HTML. Let me write up our little tags. we can put our variables inside of uh, parts of our HTML. So if we have a button or text area, I'm not sure if this is right, just guessing right now. We can echo out our variable into say text areas. This is our text area, and you can see that we echoed out our variable into here. We can also have multi-line vari variables, uh, just like this. Far equals. This is line one. This is line two. three and that would be valid oops small problem forgot to end it there we go and if we 
could also look at that out. If you have a problem with the quotation marks, such as you want to store some uh, piece of HTML code, you can change it to a single quote quotation, and a single uh, single quotation can only be, only be ended with another single. So, if so, then after you start and end with these singles, uh, no matter how many doubles you have, it won't affect the line. That is basically all for variables. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you next time. Uh, that is all. Thanks for watching.